FLX Beer Reviews, back again with another episode of As the Beer Swirls. I'm Dan, that's I'm, Mike. I'm excited. He's very excited. Yeah. Dan, why is the excitation I am in, palpable? I am in songy song, tune tune. Why? Tell me why. What could possibly get you in this? We've got company? a new brewery <gasps> on the channel today, Mike. Uh, Mike, this beer comes courtesy of our good friend Jordan... Brews and beats and brews and hip hop hats and brews and dank beats and rhymes. He's got 50 monikers, but Jordan, our friend down in Albany, uh, sent us from one of his favorite brews. Ooh. This is from the Druthers Brewing Company, located in the April in Albany, New York. And this is Triple the Reason, a double dry hopped triple I. P-A. Okay. And this is double dry hopped with Citra and Mosaic Cryo. Then they added Galaxy and Allura hops oh. to create this 10% ABV monster of a beer. And this was canned on 10-7-2024. We're about maybe two and a half weeks old, give or take. Dan, we're going a bit hard for uh, a new brewery on the channel. You know what? You got to show us all you got right here, right now. Right Brothers. now. All or nothing. I promise. Bring it on. We're not weird or psychos, and we don't usually act a fool like this, but we're pretty excited. Yeah, we are even keeled. Uh, it's a gorgeous label on this beer, by the way. I love, if I get any, uh, gorgeous get some. It looks. It's a freaking bond. You chose these glasses. Covered. I don't know how to proportion it. It's my fault he doesn't know how to pour beer. Uh, all right, here we go. Oh, what's that, Mike? Your glass is almost pretty much the same as mine. I stand correct. That's right. It's kind of humble soul I am. Uh, that looks fantastic. A real nice apricot orange. Juice. I was going to say, when I was pouring it, I was like, the first thing I thought of is like, like ripe peach juice. Oh, yeah. That too. I mean, it looks fantastic. Uh, hazy. Just... Hazy, but it's not like a really bright kind no, of hazy. It, it is kind of dark and murky and muddled. Yeah. What a real squeezed fruit would look like absolutely great little finger ahead on there nice and foamy oh swirls up nicely it look looks at that beautiful dude that head is like probably the glass shaving wear. cream thick look at that oh yeah well, like th this is a fantastic looking beer passes the eye test see what it does to the schnoz holy shit already <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. all the pineapple in the world Man, that doesn't smell sweet at all. I, well, I don't know. Little, little, I, I disagree. Well, I there, disagree. There is a little There's a little candied peach ring to it. Like there, yeah, it's candy, but it, well, I think I what, get all vegetal, like okay. right off the rip. Like I, it's like. Whoa. I think what you're trying to say, it doesn't smell like, like cotton candy. Yeah, overly sweet. Wow. Oh. It smell. It smells soft. It smells soft, and there is this, like really just underlying zip of like uh like a yuzu like a lemon yuzu kind of vibe yuzu. to it to go with that mango and passion fruit passion fruit's pretty high on this uh second to pineapple in my opinion i was gonna say like mango pineapple <sighs> little bit of red berry in there maybe a little raspberry and i love how his glasses just get the, the aromas flowing good choice in glassware yeah open your mouth while you do it <laughs> Oh, man. I'm ready to dive in. Cheers. Thanks, Jordan. Oh, boy. Dude. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Dude. Does yours look the same as mine? Mm -hmm. No, I can't see your, your hands at all. Oh, yes, it does. Let me see. It looks as oh, yeah, I knew you were gonna <laughs> I was gonna let you. I was gonna let you. Um, um go ahead. Wow. I'm I'm taken aback, let me tell you. Um Oh boy, this is I'm gonna go back to what you said earlier about fresh squeezed juice in here. This is like those uh V8 splash juices. It's got a it's a heavy body, it's thick, it's got a spritz of carbonation in there, but that juice is just like, you just squeeze the peaches in there, and you squeeze like the nectarines in there, and the mangoes in there. 
uh, you know, spritz some orange in there. It's so fruity. Jesus. And it's so, like, it's making my mouth water just talking about it. Um, the sweetness is there. I think I still get a little of that candy ring, but it is way in the back. Like, this is not overly sweet, candied sweet by any means. <laughs> Talk to me. Here's the thing. I'm getting, and uh, you didn't mention it, so maybe our palate. I've, I've got different. more going here, but I, going. I'm getting this huge like peach cobbler thing going on. There's like this peach. It's like peach and like all berry cobbler, like minus like maybe the cinnamon and graham, mm, but which like I'm fine with, but like a la mode because there is this really oh, there is a nice, nice layer of. Not even vanilla. I think it's like almost like a a roasted marshmallow kind of like a hot marshmallow kind of vibe okay. to it for the for the sweetness. Mm. Um, and nice vanilla out of it. Body is very full for the ABV. Very appropriate. Very appropriate. <clears throat> Carbonation, it's there. It doesn't zip on the tongue, but it it, it kind of lets you know. It kind of breaks things up. Mouthfeel, oily and syrupy. For an IPA? I was going to say, like, the flavors completely coat your palate in the best way possible. I don't think... I don't think it... It doesn't hide the fact that it's a triple. Like, you drink this, I can taste the big beer. I can... Like, sure, sure. I'm not saying it's boozy, but you can taste... There's a slight booze. Yes, I agree with you. But it's not an unpleasant God, booziness. It, this is very, like, nectar. Just like... yeah. Like marmalade, like IHOP, different flavored syrups. Mm -hmm. Like that's kind of like what I'm getting. Like I just take them the, the peach and nectar. It's Dude, making me aggressive. You're right, just, man. It's just you're juicing Ooh. everything into this, oh, this beer. This is delicious. And I don't know about you, but I, I'm getting like just there's a really nice bitterness, like just hanging around a little bit to just break things up. And I think it's. It's fantastic. And I'll tell you what, folks. Uh, newsflash. It's hard to craft a triple IPA that's super balanced. Because a lot of folks, they either go super sweet and it's just like, oh, my God. Yeah. Or it's just like when I say sweet, like it's just so malty. Um, but I really miss in some triple IPAs. The, the nice hop aspect that everything brings. And everything that I'm saying about this, like the muddle there, and like all that, there is on the back just a slight tomato stalk greenness to it, which I think is fantastic. Maybe a touch of pine, but it doesn't lead to, to pine so much. It's more like tomato stalk or like uh, fresh like field pumpkin kind of greenness. So to... Continue on what you're saying about triples, because um, we've made it well known that triples are not my favorite style. Um, but when I do come across one I enjoy, and that I really enjoy, like this is this is a kind of triple where, let's say I'm coming home from work and I just want one beer to sip on while I'm watching something, and this is the one I'm getting out, and I am just so relaxed. Like this beer is relaxing me, where yeah. I can just sip and enjoy this beer. Every drop, drink the whole can and be like, it stays I'm, I'm juicy. Ready. It doesn't kill the palate. No. Yeah. You're right, man. Like, it's not going, well, we can't drink any more beers today. We can't do any more. Like, like this is. Like, you're saying, I go home and palate. this is the one beer like, I want to drink, but it but doesn't destroy it. Right. Yeah, exactly. Uh, it, it's, man. Uh, what a, I, I said Albany. They're out of Albany, but apparently they have a spot in Saratoga and Schenectady. Uh, so. Schenectady. Yeah. Um, I wonder who the chick is on the label. I don't know. I can tell you the artwork. They let's the artwork uh, to let, let's read, read that this. off. That. Hops create the tropical fruit and strawberry aroma. Mm. Oh, strawberry. While big orange cream skull flavors dance on your tongue. I can okay, see I get the orange that. cream. Yeah. That there, remember I said like I'll, the roasted marshmallow. That's where I was getting a little bit of vanilla in there. So Maybe yeah, that yeah. strawberry is that greenness that I was saying. Like oh, tomato stock, but I didn't call it the green like strawberry. Yep. Um... Oh, double dry hopped, triple, no other pay. Uh, <laughs> artwork oh, by Gene Ellen Satansky, 
gorgeous at label. loves.colors. I'm going to try so, to remember to put that in the description because that is a gorgeous label. I love it. Yeah. So, uh, first experience with Druthers. <sighs> oh, I'm going to call this a four, <laughs> four all day. A four, four. Oh, man, dude, I'm... I'm up there in the four six range. Like this Holy is probably shit. one of the best triples I've no. had in recent memory. No, this I'm, I just fantastic. went to four six because I just got the berry. I just got the strawberry. <laughs> it's it's, yeah, it's in doctor high, high four six man. It, See, it's why I like reading labels because it makes me think things. I'm okay mate, having the spear make me think things. It's all good. Everything's fine. Oh, triple X I love them. Uh, thank you, George. If Druthers ever watches, they're going to be like, that guy has an aggression problem. Yeah, he shouldn't be drinking beer. But the beer just makes me this way. It's your fault. Don't brew these beers, then. Don't put such... I'm going drinking! It's <laughs> perfect name for it. We got to... Once that. it just hits your lips. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, we gotta get out of here. Hey, Jordan, if you want a streak, tell us about it. Jordan, him. you better send us more druthers. Uh, I mean, we could probably get some. We'll right? send you stuff. I gotta send them back. We gotta send them package back. Yeah, but I gotta figure. We can get druthers up. Well, there's not a fucking chance. I've never seen it. Man, maybe not. Well, because all our bottle shops closed. I feel like branching out might get druthers. Maybe. Maybe. I don't, I don't know. We'll see. All right, gang. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs>